Felt, come on. They claim they're short on beer, so I'll make them happy with that. How in the world is there a shortage of metal in Alborg? Helsinki has about a million of it. Helsinki, explain. Helsinki to Alborg, metal, tipsy mate. Why have you been inactive? That's a problem. Hmm. Oh well, get to it then. Rock says, says, I don't know which surprises me more, the fact that you're still streaming today or that I'm still watching after like six hours. It's been almost eight and a half according to this. I should probably pack up and stop. And there's probably people that uh, want me to stop. I don't want me to stop. This is somehow enjoyable. For reasons difficult to explain. Hold on, looting? Alright, that means the Dane is a bit less unhappy now. Just a bit. I mean, I wish I could just unpause and have the money flowing constantly, but those damn pirates will never stop. And I'll always have to stop and uh, crush them. But I can still watch it all flow. All that money. Oh, right, I never did move out, did I? So the problem with the uh, river cogs is that they take a lot of damage. They need grain there, don't they? The grain doesn't make you a lot of friends, but beer makes you friends. So yeah, the convoy condition degrades a lot faster on river cogs. Now, have you smashed into my coffers yet? Because I don't want you to. Alright, Cologne. Let's say hello to everybody. Hello. What a tiny, tiny place. Oh well, let's try to get popular. Wait, I'm already super popular in Cologne because I auto trade here. I wish I'd actually checked that. Happy days. Don't even think of building any more buildings here. I was doing very well here without you. I'll have you know. Ah, but you can do even better with me here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and one more for good luck. And now I can tell you to build a better wall. Ah oh man, I could have even more metal goods here. I love metal goods. You no longer need to try to produce goods here, as I am better at it anyways. You've been telling me that before, but I'm making so much more money than all of you freaks. And now we go and dump so much money in this wall. Because it has to compete against everything else. I don't think anybody's been championing the wall. I need it to have a good clean advantage over everywhere else, and that's good. Alright, well, the wild card's still sitting here going, what did I float all this way out for? So, we just dump our stuff here. I'm sure they'll be happy for it. They really wanted the beer, after all. It's not like I want this place to starve. Alright, good job. Now get back. And next up is Thorn. Also, how about for a change? Actually, why do I still 
All right, I do have a wagon. So how do I set up a wagon anything? Oh, here we go. We create a train, wagon train, on you go. Oh no, this is not going to be fun. How do I make my wagons actually have some defense? Do you just get the one of them? Just regular old wagons. Nor, as far as I can tell, can you research better wagons. Jake, you can increase the wagon carry capacity in the config. You mean the game files? That's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a way to actually defend my wagons from the looting that happens. Because there's a lot of that. Oh well, wagon trail. Uh, let's make ourselves a route then. Just auto trade because I don't care about much else. Now watch this guy get pulverized. Oh well, I thought that would be him, but no. More pirates out here. Am I being attacked? No, it's just a just a regular old pirate, Helsing. And would you believe it? Mooring fees in Groningen. Groningen. Don't see that often. Hell, one would say you don't see that ever. Goodbye, that boat. Check the city, Jake. Let's see what it looks like. And Dusty is getting pretty excited about seeing these inland trades. You and me both. Do the necessaries first though. It's just a regular shipyard here. How about making a better shipyard? Or I'll just tell them to build more cogs. I've been lacking, uh, slacking on the cog assigning. because cogs are so old school when we're looking for bigger and better things now. Carvels are plenty. I should probably do the rounds here actually. If you can bring to my table five cogs then I'll be happy. But more cogs are almost always needed. Oh, I can finally upgrade this damn thing. Well, make me a cog for now. Otherwise, yes. And I don't think I built infirmaries here yet. We're going to change that because I am not looking for extra plagues with plagues on top. Alright, Wagon Man. There he goes. Alright, Thor, well we know what Thorn is like. Carry on to Warsaw. I see you are helping me develop my city. Keep up the good work. After all this time you see that in Danzig? Alright, here we go. Inland place. This is Warsaw. It's been pretty burnt down. And I can join and build the place up. 
And I can make bigger walls and yeah, I guess I can make goods here as well. This is inland stuff. And the scope of this perfect hands, I just got that bit bigger. How am I meant to get all these goods for these guys? I'm not sure I care that much about dealing with these guys if I have to put up with a constant boom 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 of uh, wagon trading. Because yeah, this is what happens constantly. You get attacked, they take uh, some of your goods, and like I said, constantly. Here as well. Yeah, these places are all looking pretty samey to me. Don't want to be racist or anything, but that's what I'm seeing. As you know, many pirates roam the sea around here. In Posen. Well, wherever you got it, I'll take it. Probably going to stop that uh, wagon fleet because the constant explosions are going to annoy me greatly. Okay, am I finally starting to make piles and piles of metal goods? I really hope I am. Helsinki's metal problems should go away soon enough. If Harlem eventually reaches a decent level, I might be able to hold this in equilibrium. It'd be difficult, but I could. And it would rely on no other city actually building what they need to advance further. I better build up more houses in Harlem before they do that thing where, uh, where I completely forget about them. And they end up having too many houses for me to handle. The AI already got their sticky fingers stuck in here. I don't want them taking any more from me. Money is no issue. I can't see myself coming anywhere near running out of money until it comes time to pay the lords for their land. And what a money sink that is. It's obscene. It's disgusting. I guess those are the soldiers heading on home. They don't want to speak to me anymore. North of Visby, there's a floating treasure, says Lutruk. Oh, good thing Auto Shadow is there to grab it. Well spotted. 140 flotsam and it included spices, so that's happy days for me. Okay, Harlem, are you finally harvesting metal goods? No. Do I even send metal goods over there? I must have a Tools for the West. Tools for the West are a lot more important than Tools for the East. Yeah, and you're tiny, that's a problem. You're only one Hulk. But, I can change you into a bunch of Cogs instead. So yeah, I don't even know what I meant to do about uh, hooligans attacking my wagon trains, and I'm pretty sure I read that there's nothing you can do about it. I mean, I want to be wrong on that, but I can't see that being the case.
Goody. Back to Stockholm for you, though. Alright, so maybe I'm popular enough in Thorn. Not really. I thought I would have been by now, but I can grab the Coinsburg and take whatever they might want over there. So that's anything other than wine and raw materials and hemp. Uh, and meat, rather. I know what I'm thinking there, even if it didn't make much sense. Means that they will quite want some salt. They'll certainly want some tools. Everybody wants cloth. Fish. Probably quite a bit of fish. Bit of cheese. Bit of meat. Yeah, that should get us into the good books of Thorn. So research is done really quickly thanks to having seven universities. I mean, I could get some ballistics. It'll take practically no time. Thorne want me to spend tons of money, but that's okay. I actually have tons of money now. I'm just going to make myself a popular guy here. I do what called what's called the nitro movement here. Take my money. Hell, I don't need it. You're commissioning a counting house? Yep. For your own sake. You should leave it at that. Never ends for me. I expect you to either tear this house down immediately or cut me in on the profit. Remember, I was here first. I have already told you a number of times that I do not appreciate your continued expansion in my city. You're disturbing my business. Let's <laughs> see. Town is ugly, poor, and empty. Well, I do feel for Thorn here. Still. Can I tell them to make a bigger wall? Good. Thorn, you can produce for me... Gee, I'm not sure, actually. Wine is an idea, but uh, I will need somewhere else that brings food for me. Thing is, food means a lot of river cogs. Um, yeah, probably will have to be food. You no longer need to try to produce goods here. I have everything under control. Not enough control. And then I tell you, again, take that wall, build it tall. Nice. Very nice. So everything's building up fairly well. There are a few cities that I haven't really touched yet, but I mean, we can get around to them. The lords continue to be a big old pain, but things are working out real nicely. What's especially nice is that I'm not overloading too much on any one thing. I ensure... Uh, Brick and lumber, we have plenty of that, but we always do. We should have plenty of grain, that's a, that's a necessity. And I feel bad for Nafstead, it needs more people there. Many of these places looking good. So, that's what you get. Well, you know, I didn't get anything because I caught you, you fool. But that's Pomeranians for you. Fools. Flanders is happy enough. I really do wonder if I can start buying land, but it's hard to tell. I might have to make my way towards being the uh, the alderman. I'm not sure. I will run for office at the very least. I will win it, of course. I am vastly more uh, popular than everyone else. Founding of a new city? Gothenburg? What? What? How long has that been there? 
Surely, surely there are no more. Well, I'll be damned. Well, I know who I'm going to need for that. Also, what do you produce for me? Oh, yes. Metal goods and pitch. Perfect combination. And yeah, it's probably from my found city technology. Well thought. Okay, what am I wanting then? I'm going to need wild card Thagnus for it. And he's a ways away. And I'm going to need people mover. Now you're actually sitting there in uh, Navstead wondering where to get more people from. Well, Flensburg seems to have more people than they can handle. And they have plenty coming in. But the thing is, I like those people being there, so I'm uh, I'm in a rut, as you may say. Oh, it's my wife. I forgot about her long ago, but I got uh, a whole bunch of kids. Nice. I wonder if she can die. Well, I do have some people to pick up in Flensburg, at least. Actually, that means People Mover has a lot of people to grab each day. So first I'll make sure there's nobody sitting around here. Actually, they need to be there. But go to Flensburg and grab them. Uh, there's so many people in Flensburg, we could stand to have a few fewer. I don't know how you've busted through the limit, but... I don't need that much pitch. Now I keep seeing Otto what's his face there. What could it mean? Janeway is doing her own thing, Lone Shark does. And the regular old cog. But there's Thagnus, and this is what I need. Loads of you, loads of you, and then the token amount of grain just to keep people not dead. Nice. Keeping people not dead is what we do here. According to the user manual for Rise of a Dynasty, you hire mercenaries to defend your wagon in taverns. Thank you. Thank you so much. Wagon train. Right. Where's my wagon train? It's a shame they just used the same image there. Oh wait, that's not my wagon train at all. Your wagon train. Get to Posen. And yeah, get back to Riga. Gothenburg. Metal tools and pitch aplenty. Oh, I'm looking forward to that. Doesn't look like you can have any particular skills. Also, is that a pirate? Unknown pirate. Not on my watch. What? Just after I took the founding of a new city thing, this has to happen. Okay, it's unknown pirates aplenty and... It's because Walter von Pittenberg is really unhappy. Notice that they're getting unhappier faster and faster. It's because they're assholes. 
Is it just there? Is it anywhere else? It just appears to be these three. Is there an end date for Patrician 4? Uh, if there is, I have never seen it before. Please, pirates, spare me. I'm certain it's happening elsewhere. In fact, that's Novgorod for you. Probably hurting our supply Kev Dev. Well, it's such as what you get. Just beautiful. Is it not time for a pirate hunter in every city, Jake? It's starting to feel like it is. I'm not sure how well that works, though. I mean, I could put a pirate hunter on every on patrol in every single city, and yeah, how would that work? Because wouldn't they all just get laden up with stuff? They'd have to be pretty beefy as well. Oh, damn, emergency repairs. This game cannot have been pleasant to playtest. I think I'm feeling that extra damage. Or did I even research that yet? There we go. Very good. Off to Helsinki with you, of course. And nobody takes my Helsinki money but me. Get away. Clear all. I should deal with those guys at least. You are stuck there, and I've completely forgotten what I was doing before all this, but it probably involved working up Gothenburg. Eight days. You need to finish those repairs so I can actually get you to Novgorod. There we go, look at that. Plenty of goods supplied to Novgorod and it is in upswing because of it. I'm almost proud here. And I'm employing people in beekeeping and just everything's looking good. What isn't looking good is Danzig though. It's doing really, really well. And I don't like that. Not when I'm not the one profiteering. And they built a bigger wall and it's ugly as sin. It needs to be even bigger. I mean, didn't I build those tailors out there with that in mind? And they just ignored me? Bastards. I'll tell them. <clears throat> I will tell them to do better. Okay, so my wagon train. So I go to the tavern and I say... Hmm, five. 
Escort mercenaries will protect your wagon trains from attacks and tax collectors. If you say so. So if I reactivate that, you'll never get attacked. 